In this video, I'll be giving you guys a quick update on Bitcoin Cash and the crypto market. Hey guys and welcome to tonight's video. So as you guys know from my last video um, regarding the Bitcoin hard fork, um, I did decide to keep my Bitcoin Cash, not sell it off straight away like everyone else. Um, but we've had quite a bit of price action here, so I just want to give you guys a bit of detail on that and let you know what I'm doing. Um, so just over here on the Bitcoin, on the cryptocurrency market cap, sorry, um, you'll see these are the, this is the charts for Bitcoin Cash. Uh, so this price movement here up until pretty much 1st of August was before Bitcoin Cash was um, activated. And... Pretty much from about right here onwards is what we've seen. So coming around that $300 mark, we had a bit of a move up, a bit of a move down, and then we took off, guys. We hit almost 800 there at one point. Um, now, since then, we've had a massive pullback. Had a little bit of a run back up, but now we, all we seem to be doing is going down, guys. So, you know, at this point, if you're still wondering what to do with your Bitcoin cash, you know, it's a bit hard to say, um, but the, what I've done with mine is I've decided to get rid of it, guys. Um, you know, I, w I was looking at holding on to this long term, um, but looking back at Ethereum Classic and just doing a bit, bit more research, you know, I don't, I don't think Bitcoin Cash is going to get adopted as well as Bitcoin was. You know, it's hard to say what the future is going to do, but for now. Um, with the way the rest of the market's doing, I feel like it's better off having that money in another altcoin. Um, so personally, I've put mine to Omizgo, or OMG, um, which is doing awesome right now. So, you know, hopefully I can get a bit of money back there. So, obviously I'm wishing I got rid of it here up at the 800, but not much we can do about that. Um, just to show you guys in a bit more detail over here on TradingView, uh, here's a bit of another reason here. As you see in the MACD averages, um, we had this this fighting chance happening here, but we've just crossed back over, and it looks like we're going down. So, you know, it was consolidating for a while. Um, I did hold on, hold on, but now we've started dumping again, guys, and it's just been eating through these little support levels we've had here. Um, I, it's just not showing any strength in my eyes. Um, definitely selling it here or there would have been a good option, but um, you know it's hard to say. If you do, if you guys do want to hold on to it, no harm. I uh, just wanted to let you know what I'm doing. I feel like it might continue to go down further, so I felt it was best off getting out. Um, but yeah, your call on that one, guys. Um, in terms of the market, though, you know everything else is doing quite well at the moment. Um, a lot of people predicted Bitcoin Cash to get dumped and it seems like that's the way it's going but you never know if that starts getting adopted it might might start to do well but as you can see here guys in the last 24 hours Bitcoin has stepped up um, we didn't see any movement from it for a little while it was consolidating quite well um, which was good you know any actions better than no action so at least it wasn't heading to the downside. Um, the key level to watch is going to be this 2900 USD, which we're creeping towards very quickly. And if we do breach that, you know, there's some very, very bullish signs there, guys. Um, for Ethereum, we want to look at about the 240 level. Uh, it's consolidating right right now. Uh, it's showing decent strength, which is which is good. So uh, Litecoin, not doing too much, just consolidating there nicely. NEM had a massive jump, which was really good if you did manage to get in. Uh, a lot of people were reluctant on NEM, but um, it has showed some strength here and there. Ethereum Classic, as you can see, pretty volatile. Dash has had a good little bit of movement, um, nothing too significant. IOTA, guys, IOTA's taken off. Um, these good fundamental coins at the moment are doing really well. Um, IOTA's one of them, and I'm going to point out a couple others. Uh, Monero, not too bad. Stratus, Stratus is climbing nice and steadily, you know. Um, I've put a buy order in for Stratus. Um, hasn't quite been filled yet, but, you know, there's 
there's some good chances that Stratus is going to have another leg up. Um, as you can see, it's only a small percentage increase right now, and Stratus is one that's known to you know have quite a significant jump. So look for that um, to jump. Make sure you do have a bit of Stratus in your portfolio. Uh, Neo, Neo guys, um, ten dollars was the key resistance there. We've broken that, and yeah, you know, we're flying high, guys. Um, August 8th, so four days time, there's some big announcements coming for NEO, we could see you know, massive price movement coming guys, so um, look for a little pullback and uh, try and get in on a position. Uh, I don't know much about QTUM, so I'm not going to cover that. EOS is doing well, um, you know, this is one that's probably not going to move for a little while, Like, but I'm a big fan of the EOS project and um, Dan Larimer, you know, the guy's a genius, so... Yeah, I think it's going to be a very successful project. The market cap is reaching close to 500 million, which yeah, is that key sort of area to look at. Um, what's another good one here? Economy, yeah, they, re they were releasing their platform. It's not doing too well. Amise go, guys. OMG, like I just said. This one is going crazy. Very good project, this one as well. It's not just a pump coin, guys. Um, yeah, there's some good fundamental um, research and development behind this one and I think it could do quite well. Golem's up 11% so that's awesome. Um, that's probably about it for, got for now guys but um, market cap's 102 billion so I think you know the whole market in general is doing very well but um, Segwit's like almost almost activated guys it actually will lock in during this activation period um, I think it's in the 99%. It's not quite there, but um, I might bring out a video or I'll post on Steam it when it is. Um, but like, I, it's definitely right on the verge, as you can see with this price boom and a Bitcoin. Um, once that does lock in on the Bitcoin network, you will see Bitcoin start to shoot off, guys. Um, uh, it's going to show real good signs of strength. Uh, but anyway, guys. Yeah, just wanted to let you guys know basically that I have dumped my Bitcoin cash. Um, but there's some there's some really good promising projects coming up here, guys. So uh, make sure you get in, get on board. You know, hopefully the the dark times are over for crypto. You know, like with the strength going back into Bitcoin and some of these good altcoin projects coming up. You know, this is this is how crypto is supposed to be. It's um it's really exciting. So. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Don't forget to give us a like, comment, and if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, jump on board, you know. I'm bringing out heaps of content and um, doing it all to help you guys. I'm in love with the cold, cold.